Not JJ Reddick. The guy who wanted to get on after him. Oh. All right, so I'm being joined on the mic here by Jungle Chief, another Kansas player like myself. Yep. Oh, looks like we got Skillja versus Sir Shy Guy, another or a loser's bracket match. Haven't seen too many of those. So this will far. probably be a uh, fast-paced match. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. A villager versus Olimar. This is going to be exciting. Yeah, there's going to be no camping here. Oh, what's going on here? I guess he had to adjust something or other. I don't know. And he just gentlemen to to wait. Yeah, it's always nice when players are willing to do that. Like they don't. This early really in the match, it might have made more sense to just restart, but that's true. You just not just sniping those uh, Pikmin. Oh, I don't. I don't know anything about the shy guy. I gotta say, but he's uh, he's definitely in control right now. Yep, playing very solid. So, looks like our uh, our buddy Alf here. Has mostly taken control of the match, yeah. as far as I can tell. Uh, Skillager's pretty good, though. I mean, he's shown us in a lot of his earlier matches that he certainly has the uh, the skills yeah. for his uh, moniker. Yeah. I mean, he has a very good grasp of the character, I feel like. Like, he knows what he needs to be doing. So it looks like he's just using his Olimar being the uh, being the noble leader and using his Pikmin shields valiantly uh -huh. to protect himself. Yeah, I never really thought about it, but uh, Olimar seems to do very well in this matchup just because, you know, Villager can camp all he wants, but Olimar can just throw out Pikmin to uh, intercept his projectiles, and there's really nothing Villager can do about it. Yeah. Because Olimar's faster. And he doesn't rely on the ledge so much. In fact, he's bad off the leg. So, that sort of gives him free stage control while being able to handle all of uh, Villager's camping without too much trouble. Yeah. I mean, Pocket, pocketing those Pikmin is pretty amusing. Yeah, I mean, this is going to be a long match. I would not at all be surprised if this went to time. Like, I wonder... Uh, we're, we're over halfway through. Not a stock has been taken. Yeah. I mean, normally... Normally it starts to pick up after that first stock because the other player, uh, the player who lost the first stock feels the need to approach to try and tie it up. Oh, wow. I'm dropping bombs. Skillager got me with that in doubles. Yeah, Villager's forward smash is just so strong. Alright. Uh, you know, so Shy Guy was in control pretty much the entire first stock, and then out of nowhere, the bowling ball just gave. Yeah, that bowl. Oh, but it looks like there's the forward smash. Sir Shy Guy lands that forward smash, gets him, gets himself right back in the game. Right. Now that it's and tied right back up, I wouldn't be surprised if we saw them both go back to uh, the campy style of the first stock. Yeah. Two minutes left on the clock. This could definitely go to time. I, I'm I'm looking for the timeout here. <laughs> I think that'd be cool. Like people complain about timeouts, but I think they're pretty hype. They're definitely uh, they definitely take a lot of skill to play to play solid for the entire time that the timer is running. Yeah, it's and deal with the uh, the pressure of either you know when there's only 15 seconds left, deal with the pressure of getting that last few percent or uh, holding on to your lead. Yeah, you gotta have nerves of steel. If you get nervous, you will fail. So I think a lot of people don't go for timeouts because they really they're they're tiring. They can really if you go for a timeout, that could really screw over a set for you if you go for a timeout early. It's yeah. just it leaves you uh 
It leaves Mentally you exhausted. <laughs> oh no, it takes a lot out of you. Like uh, it's just it's stressful. It's a stressful thing to do, but But uh looks like Sir Shy Guy is getting kinda nervous here, possibly do. He's gotten quite the deficit and the timer is ticking down, so it looks like he's really starting to get aggressive and it's putting him in a pretty bad position. I feel like if he'd been playing this a bit more patiently, he could have probably kept it close and let it go to time, but yeah. now he's just He's, he's having a little difficulty. No. Olimar can't do that. That's unfortunate. That was, the, that was not the ending I was hoping for. But... Definitely a good showing by both players. I'm not sure what's going on here. I don't know. Skelliger might be changing characters. I, I would almost... I would have guessed that he was like a uh, one and done kind of guy. Like he had his villager and that was it. Based on the name Skelliger. Yeah, this doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to me. Especially, especially given that he Especially since lasts. he won the first game. Yeah. Like. I don't know, maybe he just thinks this will go faster. Maybe he has a lot of faith in this matchup. That's true, he might... He might just be, you know, a little tired and stressed out after a game going for that long, looking like it might go to time. He just wants, uh... Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> it seems to be working. That forward air really puts in work against uh -huh. the Pikmin. Yeah, but very rarely, and uh, almost never, would I uh, change characters after having won a game. Yeah. Mario's having, a, or excuse me, Luigi. I mean, it's easy to it's easy to forget who he is, right? Yeah. <laughs> really nice zoning by both players right now, but uh, Skillage is really cutting through with those forward airs, and that's why he has the percent lead right now. Though, right, it seems like right now, Sir Shy Guy, he was starting to get a pretty good feel for keeping Luigi out. But Things were going well, nice, then that happened. That was a nice punish. Ooh. Let's see. Uh, all right, Sir Shy Guy just sort of backed off there. Didn't even go for an edge guard. I mean, I'm not sure what he would have done. I don't know what Almar's best options are as far as edge guarding go, but. Ooh, nice down smash. Gonna go ahead and take the first stock. Yeah, so far, so Shy Guy just hasn't found a way to uh, deal with Luigi. So, I this is this is seeming pr like Luigi is pretty in control right now. I I can kind of understand this pick a little more right now, though it's not really speeding up the game that well. Oh, it's definitely it feels it game. feels slow because. It's just the same Be thing. Because Sir over Shy, over yeah, again. just Oliver, just Pikmin, 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 and forward air, forward air, forward air. Yeah. Luigi, but so it's not, it, it's feeling a little long, but I guess yeah. I looked at the timer and yeah, this is going a lot quicker with Luigi. Maybe I, he just wants to avoid that exhaustion. The thing is, I don't even know what Phil or uh, what Almar could do here to sort of get through this. I. This just sort of seems like a bad matchup, honestly. Uh, that's not even going to kill. He definitely should have gone for some pummels. Yeah. He easily could have gotten four there. Three or four. You know, it's sort of an uphill battle for a villager to actually 
get in that situation again where he can land the killing blow. Yeah, Luigi's, Luigi's just zoning Olimar hard. Uh-huh. Olimar's right at like the borderline percentage where, you know, if he takes really any more damage, it's going to be incredibly hard to bring this back. But if he gets the kill right now, it's definitely doable. Ooh. Wow, that back air, very strong. Border's not going to take it, but... Oh, he recovers high. Ooh, I would have loved to see the Shariuken. Oh. That's going to kill. And it's, you know... One of the things that you notice Olimar did before that recovery, which was kind of smart, is he threw away a bunch of his Pikmin into the Abyss, which actually uh, increased his recovery ability yeah. when he's carrying less Pikmin. It's supposed to be like, I guess he weighs less, so it's easier for the, the pink Pikmin to carry him. Right. That's an interesting mechanic. That's one of the things I love about the Smash games, especially uh, seeing, especially Smash Four, just those little things like that. Yeah, seeing, uh, seeing Olimar get punished for hitting with a down smash after what down smash was in Brawl is is really depressing. Yeah. <laughs> and that no, quite good the DI, game. Good DI. Yeah, very good DI. Just hanging in there. Ooh. Ooh, and that one, the down that smash one will lagging get it. on the Pikmin. Yep. He might not have gotten hit by that, except it lagged on the purple there. Yep. 